Doesn't this low-key look like hair? Like, this looks like a middle part, and then these look like... Another No Move On Diaries. Another intro on the MacBook. Yes! So, who's loving it? I'm loving it. This No Move On Diaries episode is just... Everywhere. Everywhere and anywhere all at once. It's a vlog day of my life, school day if you will. It is everything and anything you want it to be. We go shopping, we go to school, we give a haul, we go to the mosque, we vibe, we ride at dawn. I <laughs> hope you guys enjoy this. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this video that's very delayed. Oops. Bum ba da da! Ramadan Diaries. Episode 6! Classes are... Every single flavor. Leave <laughs> to earth. Pack it. I woke up 40 minutes early here to make this. This is the first time I've had my bagel sandwich in like... 17 days. Hey, last night and this morning, I just woke up with the most violent craving for it, and I was like, I need this now. Eggs, pre cheese, and a hash brown. Love it. Good morning, Puga! Puga! Good morning! After Fajr's prayer, I took like a little two hour nap and I woke up right now at nine. Nine. It's somehow 9 30. I don't know what I did for the past 30 minutes, but girl, I'm gonna be late! I have class at 11 a.m. today and I have to leave my house at 10 because I like to be super early at things and I don't wanna be late, so I have to leave my house at 10, so I have 30 minutes to get ready. And today I'm, is my latest day on campus because I'm gonna be there till five! I have class till five! That's actually sick. I feel good dressed. I already washed my face and I brushed my teeth. And I'm gonna get dressed. I picked an outfit last night and I hope it's good. It's a dress, it's a jean dress over jean pants. So let's get dressed. Ta Here's the outfit. I went downstairs and surprisingly my mom liked it. So we don't have to change. Obviously the hijab is not on properly, but it's this denim dress and denim jean and i feel a little silly because this hijab is just but everything else it's kind of cute i think so now we gotta get ready first thing i want to do is pack my backpack so right after that's done i can set my desk get ready and then just run out i don't know if i said this or not but one thing that i really like about amazon is that my backpack is just so empty because i don't need to take a water bottle i don't need to take any food it's just my computer and basically that's it so so nice and light and so easy to pack i love my ipad and i take my ipad everywhere school work editing journaling club another club <laughs> the number one thing that i use my ipad for though is note taking for university look at them look at them look at them look at how cute look at how much writing look how much but the thing is I like writing on paper, okay? It's crisp. It has this beautiful, matte, crunchy, crisp, delicious feeling when you write on paper. It's just so... <sighs> the girls that get it, get it. And the girls that don't, don't. So you can't really get that with an iPad. And that's why Paperlike is here to save the day. Thank you to Paperlike for sponsoring this portion of today's video. Paperlike is a company that specializes in iPad accessories. Girl, they have screen protectors, they have pencil grips, they have crease protectors, you name it. They probably have it. The product I have is called the Paper Like, and it's their original paper like <coughs> genius screen protector. If you didn't already get what I was trying to get at, the screen protector helps your iPad feel like you're writing on paper. This is the before glossy, plain, average screen. No fun. After. She's so paper right now. This feels delicious. Can you guys listen? back rubs i love i love 10 out of 10 link is in the description perfect 
I'm gonna put the blue clips on because it matches the blue of the vibes of the outfit today. Oh yeah, I think I'm gonna put on just the tiniest bit of makeup today. Just some concealer and stuff to cover. I don't know what is going on in my face, but this, this will not go away. And it's so annoying. I'll have to do it. You, 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 you. Mm, 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 mm. Like it's magnetic. You, 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 you. Wait, where's, 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 Why, for the life of me, cannot tell if I'm a cool tone girly or a warm tone girly? I feel like warm tones just look too orange ish on me. But I saw my friend Via on TikTok talking about how she was afraid of warm tones because she didn't like how orange it was too. But then she started wearing it and she realized it was so good. So I'm trying out a warm toned blush too. And I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I got this palette from ColourPop. This is a just just a flush cheek palette. And it is the most gorgeous, delicious thing ever. Ever, 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 ever. This is also from ColourPop. This is the blush sticks in the shade Cottage Life. And, babe, she's gorgeous, babe. She's gorgeous. Am I talking about the blush or am I talking about myself? You decide. I'm just kidding, I decide. Me, I'm talking about me. <laughs> really quick before I have to actually run because I have to go to school, is I got this package from this company. Well, I bought it, I didn't get it, they didn't give it to me. Anyway, it's called Resurgence, okay? And this is a Wave to Earth package. <laughs> Wave to Earth mentioned if, oh! Wave to Earth. Um, wave to Earth. Ah, wave to Earth! Ah! Um, this company, like Resurgence, sells jewelry. Like they sold lamp jewelry and other Wave to Earth. Anyways, I got this Wave to Earth package and it is so sticky cute on the inside. First, it comes with this little like photo card. Uh, not photo card, photo strip. So cute. And then a free little Bochaku sticker. This is the actual package. So I took it out, but I'll show you. Came with this little Wave to Earth ring. It just has the three hearts. So cute, so I'm gonna wear that. Came with this necklace, and the necklace had a really cute like backing, but I think I threw it away because I was so excited yesterday. Here is the necklace. So cute. This honestly did take like a month to get here. At first I thought I was getting scammed because it took so long, but it got here all right, so I'm happy. Wave to earth right now. I'm so, I'm so seasons and I'm so seasoned. I'm so seasons right now. And like, you don't even know how seasons I am right now. Actually, okay, enough. Enough, enough dilly dally yang, babe. We go, guy. Classes are finished. I went to the mosque and I played acid, and now my day is done, and it is like 5 or 6 p.m. Oh my god, today has been a long day! And those two classes, I say this in almost every single video, they're just like foundational courses. They have nothing to do with my major. They're just like foundational, like information every everyone should know. So it's a marketing and a management class. Ah! Genuinely the most useless classes ever. Like they're so silly. And the teacher, the marketing teacher, she's just like no hate, no shade. And actually all the hate, all the shade. She's just not a good teacher. Like she does not know how to teach. And today she was in a mood. The, like students you couldn't even hear them girl i was you could i have perfect hearing but i couldn't even hear them and she was like if you have a project get out you stop talking like she was in a mood she definitely woke up on the wrong side of the bed she was not feeling it anyways the other class was like a jeopardy game and it was just so like but for those two classes, it's like an hour 15, an hour 15. So it's like two hours and 30 minutes. I finished a couple assignments. I finished two homework assignments for one of my... I finished assignments, okay? I finished assignments and we're locked and we're loaded. 
and we're good to go and now we're gonna go home and my mom texted me she said she wants to have well i actually want to have pizza for if so i'm gonna go pick up some pizza and then i'm gonna pick up my little sister and then we're gonna go home and we're gonna vibe This is actually crazy because when I was on campus and I was walking to my class, for some reason, this street, like where I was walking, smelled like pizza. And it's probably because there was a pizza shop like right across the street. And it smelled so delicious and it just smelled so good. And I just smelled like pizza. And I was like, I want pizza so bad. But I was like, oh, my mom's already planning a thought. Like, whatever, I guess another time. And then my mom calls me and she's like, I mean, we have leftover tomato soup and I think some pizza would be good with it. Yes, queen. Yes, queen. Ready him, get me, get me, get me. Girl, get me with the little bloody nose. Am I eating? Feet on my bun. Feet on my bun. Let's get you. Bloody, oh. <laughs> Ready him, get your bloody face out of the. Thank you. They have every single flavor of bulldog. Oh, I don't know which one I want. Ready him, should I get. The, should I get cream carbonara? Should I, could I get cream carbonara or just normal carbonara? Normal? Get what you want. I want the normal one. That is normal. That is normal. Oh my god, Maria. Is this the carbonara flavor? Yeah. This is crazy. <gasps> I need that. Can you hold you this? Know, in the That's like, disgusting. <laughs> Can you? <laughs> Made it home just in time for thought. Helped out with the table and everything. Don't worry. But then I started to break my fast on a day per use. And after I break my fast, I like to just go pray the afternoon prayer Maghreb right after. And someone was like, why? Because I like to. Anyways, uh, the main meal was tomato soup. And mm, 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 I love tomato soup. I genuinely think it's one of my favorite soups. And I was putting some chips on top for a flavor combination. And then for some weird reason, I was just violently craving a chili dog, like a chili hot dog. I don't even know where this came from because I'd never eaten one before today. So I, I had a chili hot dog and then tomato soup and then the pizza. When I tell you, I was just going back and forth between soup, hot dog, and pizza. It was crazy. My mouth was on a flavor explosion roller coaster that day. 10 out of 10. Loved it. The lighting is horrible. I apologize. I don't know where else to put you. Somehow, someway, I'm going to make it late to Tarawih again. So I'm rushing, but I'm so tired, so tired, so tired. And I feel like I'm going to fall asleep, but I can't fall asleep because I have so much homework and I'm so stressed and it's just so bad. <laughs> I'm ready late to Tarawih, like I said, as per usual. And I feel like I'm going to fall asleep, but I can't fall asleep because I have so much homework. But I have a Celsius and I know energy drinks are so bad for you. I know energy drinks. I literally have not had this since last Ramadan, literally a year. And I just feel like I'm going to fall asleep. And just this once, I can't fall asleep because I have homework. Because I'm a junior in university and the teachers just want to kill me. That is like violently green. That should not be in a human being's body. Peachy. Want to be in the YouTube video or do I cut this out? It doesn't matter. <gasps> okay. I watched them. They're <laughs> <laughs> praying apples. <laughs> We're walking in sync. <laughs> we are back home. Am I tired? Yes, actually, no. Drinking that energy drink. I literally drank four gulps. One, two, three, four. Four. That was it. And I feel like I could genuinely take over the world right now. Anyways, I didn't give it to you earlier. So here's a haul of everything I got from the Korean Mart. I got my favorite ramen. This is Bulldog uh, Carbonara. The best ramen bag. And then I got a bottle of Sriracha. It has been genuinely like two years since I have seen a bottle this big. I was impressed and I got it. And then I got these. These are little uh, assorted jellies. They're like little jelly candies. I'll take one. I tried the blue one earlier. Honestly, it was not that good. Cinnamon. Ugh. Are you going to try the pink one or the red one? It has such an interesting texture. I'm not really the biggest fan, but that's what it looks like. On a scale of one to sweet, this gets a zero. Like, it's not sweet at all. Um, the texture is like if Turkish Delight had like two times more of a gelatinous feel to it. 
I don't know why I did that. Then I got this. This is plum hard candy. Genuinely, like this was my childhood snack. Like every time I'd go to the Korean Mart, I'd get a bag of these. I'd get a bag of Korean onion ring chips and I'd get a little soda for 50 cents. I got a cream bread. I normally get custard bread, but this had cream bread. We'll try the like half and then we'll save the other half for support maybe. Where's the cream? Oh, whoa, I thought it was gonna be like white cream, but that low key looks like the custard bread. Mmm, smells like a hot dog. Oh, whoa, wait. <laughs> Is this hot dog bread? I didn't even see that. Is this just stuffed hot dog bread? And I got some turtle chips. Who remembers this from last year at Amazon Diaries? Then the thing that I'm most excited about, because I keep seeing these mukbangs, I've seen them for ages, and I'm like, where do people get these from? Ginormous rice cake sticks. Literally, look how freaking big these are. But I'm so excited! I'm gonna make an egg, and I'm gonna have some kimchi, and I'm gonna have seaweed. Oh, babe. Oh, babe. That was my haul. <laughs> 